Welcome back everybody you already know this your girl has been sent i want to thank all my subscribers i truly appreciate y'all okay so this is going to be your daily vibes for july 11th keep in mind this re is general and it may not resonate with no damn body you see what i'm saying now let me tap right in because the vibration okay that i'm feeling for july 11th it's like okay i feel like somebody could have like betrayed a motherfucker you know um this is like doing something that you regret okay because it's like somebody could have wanted to see someone somebody may want somebody time attention affection or whatever the case may be but somebody could have been in a space okay where they just didn't want to be bothered or maybe they was going through some shit spiritually or it's just you know a mood you know motherfuckers just couldn't really get it together in that moment it wasn't nothing personal motherfuckers just wanted to be alone type shit and i feel like somebody could have misjudged a person in that moment like they could have thought a person was on some bullshit they thought a person was lying they thought a person was doing this that and the third but in reality a lot of people be going through certain shit you know what i'm saying like some internal shit spiritual shit you know and a lot of people don't talk about certain shit you know what i'm saying so they just give people space you know like okay I just talk to you tomorrow this ain't really a good time or you know I didn't call you back because you know it ain't you it's just some shit I'm going through like people don't realize people be really going through some shit you know what I'm saying and certain motherfuckers be thinking that certain people be on bullshit and they don't okay it's just certain shit that motherfuckers gotta you know work through so somebody could have did some you know foul shit betrayal stab backstab a motherfucker you know whatever you consider like betrayal to you you know what i'm saying it always got to be a motherfucker cheating or motherfucker doing this it could just be doing something where it's like okay it kind of affect the motherfucker like you kind of bogus if you look look at it like that so i feel like somebody may have done some bogus ass shit you know to a motherfucker just because of some shit that they pretty much thought motherfuckers was doing but in reality motherfuckers ain't on shit so while motherfuckers ain't on shit and motherfuckers you know misjudge the situation they may have done something where they thought this was gonna make them feel good and at the end of the day it made them feel like shit okay so a person you know made the wrong move dealing with a certain situation okay they thought they was gonna get something about something and it ain't do nothing but makes this person feel even more fucked up than they already was feeling you know what i'm saying i feel like it was something dealing with ego or something like that it, it, it's like i'm i'm hearing like okay another day was coming like it was always a new day type shit like this person pretty much saw that they was working out of ego like ego was leading them leading the way you know what i'm saying and ego can really lead you down the wrong fucking path you know and this is one of them situations where it's like yeah motherfuckers made the wrong judgment here because it, it wasn't really 
whatever a motherfucker was going through, it was something personal. It was something internally. It was something that a person may have to deal with on their own. And somebody may just wanted to see somebody or talk to somebody or hang out with somebody or something like that. But somebody could have not been in that space. You know what I'm saying? And somebody may have took that as like, okay, betrayal. So it's kind of like revenge. But this person just feel fucked up for even it wasn't even called for like it, it was it's irrelevant it's it it feel wrong you know what I'm saying it feel wrong I feel like so when it comes to like any type of I feel like the loyalty is out the window I feel like somebody was real loyal to a person, real dedicated to a person, you know, been dealing with a person for a minute, but the betrayal, the backstab or, you know, put a person in some type of mental state, you know, making a person think this way, like, it's the betrayal. It's the betrayal. So the loyalty is out the window. Now it's like, okay, I don't trust you. Like, I will never trust you. I can't trust anything you say. So once the trust is out the window, pretty much the relationship is out the window. Because it's like, I don't even know what to believe. I feel like you just want to move forward mentally. But no hate in your heart dealing with it. Like, you don't have no hate in your heart for this person. It's like, okay, I just want to move forward mentally. Like, I'm not trying to be in some type of inner conflict with myself dealing with the situation. It's like, I just want to have a clear head, clear thoughts, you know, moving forward. I feel like... The burden of it, like just letting it go is is so it's like you can breathe it feel like you can breathe or something like that like the pressure is off the 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 heaviness of the situation like letting it go it feels so much better letting it go than holding on to it you know what i'm saying it feels so hard like this relationship feels real hard I feel like you know if this person like went backwards where okay they may have thought you was on some bullshit just trust and believe another person knows like what's going on with them like so it, it's like okay somebody knows it's the issue between you two because that's why they coming around them you know what i'm saying it's given that it's given that because i feel like you're going to be talking to somebody new you know somebody new is going to want to talk to you i feel like you're going to be having a conversation with somebody new and this is serious you know what i'm saying um it's a serious conversation who knows if it turns into commitment it could just be like okay you love listening to a person or a person loved listening to you talk or something like that um i feel like if this person was trying to talk to somebody serious it's like it ain't going nowhere because somebody here is not looking for a commitment you know what i'm saying it's like this person feels so worse for whatever the fuck they done it don't even make sense it don't even make sense and i feel like this path is like the, the something shifted like something changed within this situation where this person is going to find themselves moving moving backwards like everything is going to be like you know how motherfuckers be like damn you you went through that shit again like you going through that shit again like like reliving shit it's something with this person not learning shit obviously because it's like you're going backwards a lot of things this person is going to be doing is backwards like you, it, it may be something where it's like okay 
even if you do still talk to this person or this person is texting you you're not responding or something like that you're gonna be reading these messages like didn't you go through that shit already it's like it's gonna be the same shit this person is moving backwards like redoing shit re like you gonna be like what the fuck hey. like you ain't doing shit new this is all old you going through all old shit again you reliving something this person is gonna be reliving the past because it's like it's the betrayal it's the betrayal this person is toxic that's it this person is toxic this person needs to go through uh, like several this person is going to be going through several like four transformations back to back to back to back for them to even get to a certain level for them to even get to your level this person is going through transformation 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 A lot of Scorpio energy is in this person's energy field. And while they going through that type of shit, you gon' it's something with a new soulmate, y'all. This shit came up already. Something with a new soulmate. It's a new soulmate here. Okay. And I feel like you may learn a lot, a little bit or whatever, but take from, take something from it. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be learning something new because it's a new person, a new experience. So don't be afraid of the new. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty much all I got. Thumbs the fuck up if that shit just made sense. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, y'all.